Hello, my name is Eric Trac and welcome to another awesome tutorial video for Jump Social. Today I'll show you its system requirements and how to actually install it on your site. It's pretty simple, so let's get to it. We start by going to documentation.jumpsocial.com and the first link on the site, the content of the site, is system requirements. Let's just click it and here you have the whole list. It's a pretty long document with screenshots, so it's easy to read, easy to follow. You have basically step-by-step -step instructions so you shouldn't get lost. Let's go back to, to system requirements. Jump Social requires it has its system requirements as any program so it does need PHP of 5.3 and above or above it does need MySQL 4.1 or above and uh, some of those settings some of those requirements you can check in the backend of your Joomla site for example you can check if you have CRL library installed so let's just select and copy CRL go to the backend of my site navigate to site system information and go to PHP information just by using the search function in the browser I can look for CRL and the second CRL on my on this site is uh, has taken me to its settings so I know that it's enabled on my site I can see all the other information about it so I know it's there let's see if I have um for example something else okay what's my memory limit why right? I want to check my memory limit in PHP dot in file so again go to the back end the same location use the browser search function type in or paste in the phrase you're looking for and you have a memory limit right I navigate to it and you can see I have a memory limit of 90 megabytes so it's all there I'm not gonna check every single system requirement because you can do it on your own uh, and there's no point frankly uh, I just want to tell you that some of those settings you can check in the back end of your site but some of those you will need to consult your hosting uh, about for example FS OCK open let's check if this is available go to the back end just paste it and as you can see it doesn't find anything I know that it is there on my server right but it doesn't show in the back end so some of those you will need to consult your hosting if you're not sure whether uh, those extensions are, are installed or not 